for today's video on my mom's channel, we're going to be opening our baby brother's new stroller that we got from Target. I think it's open now. Nope, you gotta do this first. Oh, how? Oh. Don't cut it towards you. Man. Hey. Alright. Go inside. Yay! Part. Part. Okay. Well. Let me do the parts. Part. Part. So we have the wheels slash tires. I actually thought it already had came assembled. <laughs> 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 so <laughs> This will be fun. Ah. This, is, um... <laughs> this will be fun. Oh god. <laughs> yeah. Take this out. Oh my god. So these are the wheels, guys. Nothing really special, just wheels. What are you doing? Oh yay! So this is one of the trays. This is the trays where we put the cups and the food. How would you do that? I'm gonna hit you back. I'm gonna lie. Yay! Seat. What is this, Maddie? A car seat. A car seat for the baby! Just sure. like Pepe! <laughs> Both of you are incorrect. I didn't say anything yet. <laughs> what is this? That's yeah. the car seat base. Car seat base. Oh, okay. That's the base. Well, you guys wanna say? Let me take your time. <laughs> Base. It's pretty heavy, but this is the car seat base. What it looks like, if you want to know. All right, so this Yay! is the actual car seat. Yay! Let me this is so action. awesome. Let's take a look. I'm gonna let you do it here. Okay. So this oh, is the actual car seat. It smells seat. so good. So I'm like, I'm almost in tears. So the inside, the <laughs> it inside. It's like a fresh pair of shoes. The inside has black and white stripes, and then it has like the importance of the stuff and like the, the instructions. instructions. Yeah. So yeah, if you want to buy the stroller, it already has the instructions. So you have to and that is like a jean. It's like a fresh pair of shoes. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's it like does. a jean Smell material. It. Mommy. Smell this. Let's go ask Brandon Christian. Mommy, Smell look. That's the brakes, I think. So these yeah. are the brakes. So if you're wondering, it does not come assembled with the thing, but the brakes come by itself. So. Another wheel. So you know what you have. Some more assembly <laughs> tools and instructions. But you can do for it, Dad. Midi. Yep, you can do it. To put together. We have a lot of memory foam, so if you have kids, make sure they play with the memory foam, because memory foam is really good for your kids. <laughs> and it's not memory foam. Right? What is this? I don't know what it is. Just packing. Packing material. Packing material. All right. This would be like the. It's another seat. It's it like turns the, into a bassinet. Right. And it's the. I think that's the car seat. Like the top, I mean the um. It's like stroller. a to toddler. Yeah. Seat stroller. So this is the toddler seat stroller slash. And this is a jean seat. like a jean material which I love. It has the black and white pattern, just like the car seat. It also has little straps. It's pretty big, and this is what like it looks like with all the stuff. And yeah. All right, here's another tray. It goes. I think it goes in the very back. That's the parents. Yeah, the parents tray. This is the top tray, the parents tray, and they have two cups and then a little compartment. Can't open it. There it is. And you put your little like fruit snacks or anything in there. So one time, if we go to Disney World again, you can put it in there. And this is the primary portion of the stroller that you attach the wheels to and the handle and all that stuff. And um, this is going to be quite a task and interesting. But um, yeah, that's it. Oh, I didn't even see that happening. See? I don't think it's going to take you long to do it, though. 
We shall see. And I'm quite sure that you and your sister are going to want to play with the box so you guys can have it. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> I want to see if I can go in the box. Alright, what's up peeps? This is the Graco Mode's 3-in-1 travel system. Just finished putting together uh, at the 
uh, luxury of my wonderful children and beautiful wife. As you can see, I have a shirt on. I love my hot wife. But I just finished putting it together. So this right here is the actual car seat. As you can see, this little canopy that comes over the canopy. Open it, close it. You can look in there and see the baby as you're riding. Um, and this is like just like a little flap here you, if you don't want to extend the whole thing. But I'm going to take this out real quick so you can see how the three-in-one travel system works. So this is the canopy again, like I said. You can put the canopy over like that. Um, you can have the, like right now I have it back, but this is typically for like, you know, if you have a larger child or if the as the child gets older, you can buckle them in, sit it in there. I'm quite sure my youngest daughter would like to demonstrate. Come on. Got to take this part down. Oh yeah, forgot about that. This and look, this right here. If well, I'll show you when we get to that point. But put that down. She's a little bit too big, of course. So I'm not gonna do all that. But why do she's a lot big? And I'm quite sure she's enjoying herself right now. <laughs> so. How old are you, Mallory? Six. And when are you going to be seven? In a month. So she's a little too big for this, but we just wanted you guys to see. Um, that six-year-old can fit it. Yeah. But not the buckle. All right, so, I mean, I'm pretty sure you can adjust the buckle, but just for the sake of this video, I'm not going to do all that right now. All right, so on to the rest of the video. This right here is the little tray for the snacks and all the little items that the baby wants to use, want to play with, thank you, assistance. And let's just say, for instance, like we said, we just put this little foot rest down. And you want to turn this into a bassinet. This is for all those great dads and moms out there. Graco, shameless plug. All right, so you can put this up. Bring this back. And let me see. I think I forgot how to do it. Push it. Oh yeah, you gotta pull the little thing back here. So you pull it back here, it locks, and it can come down and turns into a bassinet. So let's just say you don't want to use the car seat to ride around it, put the baby in. It's I just think a, it, go, it goes lower than that, actually. I think I put it back as far as I could. Hold on. Because that's that's about as far as it can go. Okay. But, turn it turn it to the side, please. But it's still, I mean, it's, it's, it's reclines enough. So this is a little bassinet. I'm gonna put it back up. So this is a recline again. Turns into a bassinet. Bring it down. Bring up a little foot rest, but too little. Uh, adjusters on the side here that you bring the footrest up, down, and up, and you can lay it down. I'm gonna bring it back up, and it locks already in. Bring this little footrest back down, put the tray back over, and my daughter has been wanting to talk about what this is. So go ahead. So. Basically at the top, you're not supposed to have a good job to talk about it, but I'm still going to talk about it. So at the top, you basically have two, a parent tray, you grow up snacks in the middle compartment. Yeah, or snacks for your other offspring. And it says you cannot have like warm cups of coffee or anything. All right, so another way to kind of utilize this, um, got to get the most out of the three-in-one travel system. So what we're going to do, we are going to get some little notches on the side here. And you take it up like this, as you see, it detaches. So you just have it to where, you know, you can take the seat out. You can turn this bad boy around, 
like this here. Right to your parents. And you can have your little one facing you. Still got the canopy going. If you need some shade, I'm gonna just strip it back. Just take a quick look at that. And so that's another creative way you can do it. Um, same way, as I said before, you make it to like a little bassinet, bring it down, bring a little footrest up, and baby wants to sleep, um, toddler wants to sleep, you gotta be quiet enough so they can get some good rest without being fussy. So bring the footrest back down. Um, another way, I'm gonna take this out. And let's just say you don't wanna carry this big thing around. Let's just say, for instance, baby's brand new, just came home. This is not really necessary for the moment time being. Let's just say baby's asleep in the car seat. And you just wanna let baby get some rest. Don't wanna disturb baby. You can take the car seat, and guess what? Same thing. The car seat, let me make sure I got it done. You can set it in there just like that. Cover baby up if you need to. Roll a little handle back. Cover baby girl or baby boy up if you need to. That's right. And boom. That's your three-in-one travel system. I love it. My wife brought turned me on to it. Um, when she, I first initially wanted like a, a three-wheel stroller, um, tri-wheel. But when she told me about this, I was just so, I guess, not overwhelmed, but um, all of the nuances and features of this stroller really stood out to me, and I think. Her recommendation was a great choice. And so you got a very, very fully functional stroller and got so many things you can do with it. Um, and it just makes it a lot easier for the parent. And as the child develops, you know, you just got different ways you can kind of make it work for you and your family. Um, and yeah, like I said, it's just fully functional. And I think another thing that I really like about this stroller, take a little thing back here, take it out, you got a little, notch in the back like in your other strollers to pull it up but when you're ready and i hope i'm doing this right yeah so just pack it up you can just uh pack it up throw it in the back seat you got your car seat you don't have to have a bulky stroller in your back seat a bulky stroller in the trunk. Um, I mean, it's just a very, very good uh, travel system for the baby and for the family. And so, and I believe while my wife is still filming, um, I want to make sure. Well, let me just bring this. I think there's something on here that locks it. Yeah. So it has a little lock on here once you put it together. So if you're not, once you finally get do it, just remember there's a little lock over here once you put it together. Make sure you release that lock before you expand it so you won't break the stroller. And you put it back out. Now I'm not 100% sure, I'm gonna see something. What I thought, I could be wrong, yeah. If you have to put it up with this in it, and say, for instance, you don't need that car seat anymore. You can just take these off, take your little tray off. And say you just wanna have this in here, but you have like a older toddler. You don't need the big, the little small car seat, but you need a booster seat. You can still keep this attached. Put this in the back of the trunk, back of your SUV, back of your ride. And you'll be good to go. So. That's our review, that it put together. Mommy's great recommendation. Now, like, comment, subscribe to my baby's YouTube channel. And 